Hi, how you doing? My name's Janine. This here is my lovely model Brock, and today we're going to show you how to do some GHD curls. Okay, so as you can see, um, with Brooke here, I've already prepared a lot of the hair because, you know, we don't want to be here three days while we go through this. But um, what I'm going to do is show you how to make the shape with the curls and, and the difference between getting it bouncy and getting it flat and that kind of thing. Um, you'll see that I've taken the section straight back. I'm still going to put a part in for Brooke, but personally I don't like it to be too flat at the roots. And if you section off and do your GHD curls on a part like that, it'll always be really flat at the roots. So to get the hair ready, comb it out, a bit of heat protect, my favourite is um, Trilliant from Sebastian. Smells really good which has nothing to do with anything but it does make it nice to use. So with your GHDs, to get root lift, put them in and clamp the hair lightly and start turning it immediately straight away from the root and then hang on to that tail. And if you want some extra curl, you can wind it back down and take the hair out. And what happens is by taking it through the middle like this is that we just get nice easy movement and no hard parts. So I'll show you that again. Turn it all the way over, hang on to the tail. And make sure you turn it back on itself because that lets the hair cool down in the shape that it is and it means that your curls will last longer. Um, I've put um, some blow waving lotion into Brooks here and I blow waved it in before I started because that makes the curls last longer. If you're not going to put any styling product into the hair, there's nothing to hold the shape. And hairspray is for at the end of things. So hairspray is to finish the look, not to create the look. So always use something to start with. And before I start styling it, I give it a little spray. So now that we've got all the curls, we're going to put in a bit of a part. I think that the centre part is going to come through really strong again for summer. And now it's about breaking up the curls. So you don't want to leave them all put together and too done. We want it to be really easy and lived in. So just running your hands through gently and it breaks up the curl and gives the hair movement. Um, you can use a bit of gloss as well. I like this one. Okay, just a little bit all over the hands like hand cream. And then when you put your hands into the hair, start through the mids and ends before you get anywhere near the roots so you get that lift as well. If you've got really fine hair like Brooke has, um, a really groovy wee product that helps for that lift and for making it last all night is this one here. This is dust. So this is weightless and it's got a really good grip with it and it's for elevating those roots. So you just kind of tap it in like icing sugar and then you rub it. And as you rub it, it grips and you get volume out of the roots and it gives more of that lived in look. So, you know, for me personally, I don't like hair to be too perfect. I like it to look like you've been out having a fabulous time. And then rubbing it in there like that. So there we have it, lived in GHD curls.